Okay, now I've removed the, I guess it's like a, a top guard uh, of the bearings here. And uh, you've got access to the shaft. Now, I don't know if these are, if this is a uh, ball bearing that requires grease or if, if they are uh, sleeve bearings. So I'm going to have to take a look at it and see. I may need to go get some lithium grease and... Uh, We'll have to see how, how it looks inside there. So anyway, just a little small update. I've now removed the bearings from the uh, shaft of the Rex fan. And uh, I've got them soaking in a degreaser, but uh, to be honest, I think uh, the uh, one bearing needs to be replaced because you can see some eccentricity to it. It looks like it, it got worn down. Um, probably from the pressure that the belt uh, pulls on the shaft for all of, all these years it, it looks like maybe uh, it eventually wore it down and uh, th these bearings had grease in them and they let, they appear like to me that they were uh, porous bronze bearings based on the color and uh, they should actually have oil in them not not grease and probably that having that grease in there created a lot of extra heat and maybe that's what caused that bronze to soften and warp like that. I'm not really sure. I don't understand a whole lot about uh, these types of uh, mechanical things, but it appears that uh, it just received a lot of wear. And uh, I was going to try and use this bearing how how it is, just clean it up and um, reintroduce oil to it. But I think I'm going to have to have this one replaced, and hopefully uh, there's a replacement part that's uh, big enough that'll fit it. Or, or I mean the right size it'll fit it so uh, this is how it looks without any any shaft in there or bearings and um, yeah so it'll be nice to eventually be able to use this fan it's got a real heavy duty uh, shaft and, and uh, sheave on it or shiv and uh, yeah, I'm excited to, to finally be able to use it soon